So now that you've created your website, it's time to get it set up so that it will be ready for building content, adding pages, and getting it ready for being searchable on the internet. So if we click back up here onto dashboard, and this will take us back again into the dashboard area, which is kind of like the behind the scenes or the back end of the website. So first thing we need to do is have a look at the updates here. And you can see that there's now um, a new version of WordPress available. So you just simply click the update button now, and this will automatically install the latest version of WordPress. So as soon as that's done, um, we can also update any of the plugins. Now that's finished we can click on plugins here and update any of the plugins so that we're using the most up-to-date version. So you can see that the all-in-one SEO pack um, has already been installed and we just need to activate this. So click on the activate button. It's now also saying that there's a new version so we can update that one as well and it's updating and we can work our way down and you can see here the WP spam shield um, we can also update that one and now all of the plugins are up to date now we want to go back to the dashboard and we can see that there are a couple of things that we need to delete. For example, here we can see um, this is a comment which is pre-installed to demonstrate comments and we can simply trash this one by clicking on the trash button. Okay, that's now deleted that one. And we can also look for a post. Click over here on posts and there will be pre-installed post saying hello world um, again we can just delete this one here um, if you hover over this one and click trash that will delete that post so we can see that there's one more update over here on dashboard and it's a theme update so the theme that we installed the rethink theme um, has got a, an update available so we can select it and click update themes. Now it's time to build out the website by adding some pages and content.